This is Phil White with the Adventist Review, and uh, today we are interviewing a newly elected vice president of the General Conference, and your name is? Audrey Anderson. Tell me, Audrey, uh, what is your background that brings you to this position? I've served as the executive secretary of the Trans-European Division for the last 11 years, and prior to that, um, in the Swedish Unions as executive secretary, I'm a commissioned pastor, um, grown up in a pastor's home. Uh, the church is my life. So um, what will be your role then uh, in this position? You are the only female vice president, is that correct? That is correct. And I'm making the transition from secretariat to presidential. So. At the moment, I don't know that much about my role, but I look forward to discovering what it is. So let me just ask you a question. Was this a surprise to you today? Um, there had been a conversation a little bit before, um, but yes, I mean, it. it is incredibly humbling to be asked to serve um, the Lord and his church. So always calls come as, as a surprise. So this is going to be a huge move for you because, um, you know, you're from the European continent and I assume uh, grew up there and now you're going to transition to a new continent. I am. So it, it is a big transition, yes. Let's talk about what your responsibilities will be. Well, you know, I am, like I say, I am very familiar with Secretariat, I am not familiar with Presidential, and this is, these are discussions now that will happen over the next few weeks as to what my responsibilities, what my assignments, what departments I will work with, yeah. What does this, you had said that you are a commissioned Seventh-day Adventist minister as a female, what, what does this mean to you for women in active service for the Lord? You know, I believe that the Lord calls all people to serve him and it is an affirmation that women have a role to play in the life of the church. So what do you see uh, from your perspective? Um, I realize as you transition to a new position uh, you're going to now have a more global perspective than you currently have but what do you see are the greatest needs of the Seventh-day Adventist Church right now? I think some of our greatest needs are to see how we can reach the unreached, to find new ways to use technology, to use all kinds of methods. Time is so short, and for me it is mission. How can we be the Lord's arms and feet and reach those people who today don't know our wonderful, beautiful Savior? Thank you so much. God bless you in your new role. And catch more of our content on AdventistReview.org.